Welcome to Children's Liturgy Online for Sunday, February 14th, 2021. I'm so glad you've joined with me today on Valentine's Day. Let's begin our time with prayer. We begin in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who've trespassed against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Well, it's Valentine's Day. And it's a day that we celebrate loving and being kind to one another. It's also a day when we're reminded of God's love for us and how he wants us to show love to others. How do you show love to others? I hope you're showing love to those that love you and are closest to you. It's usually easy to love people who love us. But what about people who we don't know as well or people who are left out? Are you kind to them? In today's gospel, we'll learn about how Jesus was kind to a man with leprosy. Do you know what leprosy is? In Jesus' day, leprosy was a skin disease that made the skin look really ugly. No one wanted to be around people with leprosy, and they definitely didn't want to touch them because they were afraid they would catch the disease. People with leprosy had to go live outside of town all alone. They knew what it really felt like to be left out by everyone. But Jesus didn't act like other people. Let's listen to Mark's Gospel and hear what Jesus did. A leper came to Jesus and kneeling down begged him and said, if you wish, you can make me clean. Moved with pity, he stretched out his hand, touched him and said to him, I will do it, be made clean. The leprosy left him immediately and he was made clean. Then warning him sternly, he dismissed him at once. He said to him, see that you tell no one anything, but go, show yourself to the priest and offer for your cleansing what Moses prescribed. That will be proof for them. The man went away and began to publicize the whole matter. He spread the report abroad so that it was impossible for Jesus to enter a town openly. He remained outside in deserted places and people kept coming to him from everywhere. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. In today's Gospel, we heard about a man with leprosy who fell on his knees and begged Jesus to heal him. The gospel says that Jesus was moved with pity, or in other words, he was filled with compassion for the man. We can see that Jesus loved everyone, even those who were outcast or left out by others. And even though this man had a terrible skin disease, it says that Jesus stretched out his hand and touched him. No one else would even go near the man, but Jesus, Jesus showed the depths of his compassion by touching him and healing him. The leprosy left him immediately. Can you imagine how the man felt? First of all, he, he felt the love of and compassion of God in a very personal way. And second, to be healed of a horrible disease so that now he would no longer have to be alone, but he could live with other people again. What an amazing story of the love and compassion of God. My prayer for you today is that you would experience the love of God in a very personal way. And I also pray that you would show the love of God to others today, especially those who feel left out. Let's close our time with prayer. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, a world without end. Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. Well, thank you again for joining me today. Have a fabulous Valentine's Day and a great week ahead. We'll see you next time.